Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. So I'm going to work on this a little bit more today. I'm going to work on this as the sage. So I thought I would just come on and see how you guys are doing. Um, I want to try to get this done because I have so many other things in the works. But, um, so I thought we'd play with this. So I want to make it sage and I want to make it, I'm going to use a uh, classic green and see this might still be a little too dark. I'm gonna take the plastic off, Cal. I've been, we just watched RuPaul last night and all I keep wanting to do is, why don't you come up and see me sometime? Boo! Uh, it's ridiculous. Nobody's here to laugh at me but me. I'm gonna strike this and get this to be thicker. I don't know, do any of you guys watch that? I don't know, I just keep laughing. Why don't you come up here? So now like all my, that's my voices all the time. I talk to Dave. And that's my special voice. All right, is this gonna be sage? Well, yeah, it's gonna be sage, but it's gonna be a little wild sage, as I like to call it. Wild. Up on the top, but what I'll do is I'll wrap it in a little bit of some something. Don't put it in your drink. Don't put it in. Oh, I want to show you this too. I keep using them because they're sitting here. But look how awesome these came out uh, with the watercolor when I did it. Right? I'll probably use that to still wipe on. But I'm going to use this as an ATC background. I mean, like, look at that. It's like a little watermelon. So I love these. I'm going to. Oh, I got something in my eye. How cute. They're just paper towels. So remember when you're using them, you know, sometimes they get a junked up, which this will get, unless it comes out pretty, but sometimes they're just really nice to use. See the voice? Oh, I gotta stop. What is wrong with me? This is happy green. Happy green. Okay. I just want some. In there for a little bit of dimension. Because I want it to be like individual. I mean, I know it's sage. Because I was thinking, I'm going to just do this for some texture. I was thinking like, I don't know how well you can see it. <sighs> even putting a little bit of like purple in here like because I have some that are lavender and sage so I might do a little bit of purple just so those little stringies out there are little flowers you know so yeah I might do that too once it's dry and then I'll wrap it with I always like the red string around mine so that'll probably be what I do And I want to do the sky a light blue. So I'm going to move this out of the way because I will dip my brush in it accidentally. Okay. I asked this in my uh, vlog that I did, but I'll ask it here as well because I know not everybody watches my vlog. But let me know down below if you would be interested in uh, me putting up my canvas behind me um, and then filming me doing, because I've been doing like a lot of abstract and playing around a lot. So let me know down below. That'll dry fast. So let me find my purple, whereas you guys call it purple. Okay. Oh my god, my dogs. What a morning with these dogs today. Oh, that's a pretty green too. What color is this? This is called Fresh Cut Grass. That's nice. Oh. Maybe I'll run this through the purple. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Okay. I get 
so excited. This is called Perfect Purple. Maybe I'm going nuts being in the house. I don't know. I'm always in the house, but the thought of knowing I have to be in the house doesn't make me happy. Okay, I'm just going to do some light dots through it because I love lavender. As a matter of fact, I am making candles with lavender uh, and I have real lavender through it and stuff like that. Little, um, little spell candles, little positive, relaxing candles. I'm going to put a few up for sale if anybody's interested. And they're just not tea lights, but they are um, votives. I'm just going to run this through and then I'll pull the green through it one more time. One more. Yeah. Oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. Okay. I'm not mad at it. Nope. But one thing I do have to do is dry it before I put the, yeah. Okay. So I want to rinse my bras. I'm trying to. And I think what I'm going to do is when I start filming again, because I'm still in the process of doing my desk, I'm getting there though. I'm happy with it. I'm going to move my water over here. So I'm not like over, um, just, you know, <laughs> that's, that's me up in my production. <laughs> She's going to put her water here, you know? <laughs> oh, Kelly is so funny. Okay. Don't ask. I'm going to dry it. Now I was thinking about doing a little bit of white, a little bit of white on the purple to brighten it up, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Here's my dog again. My dog today, Spyro, is so unsettled. Like he doesn't know what he wants. I mean, he's old. He's just not doing good today. I hate that. And I put him his special blanket down on the floor, but the other dog went and laid on it and he doesn't want to, neither one of them want to share. So that it's just a mess. I'm doing a little bit of white. I'm just using gesso and I'm just doing little, little dots, kind of like a baby breath dot, but it's just going to help with the purple a little bit. So yeah, so I'm hoping Dave, Dave's not, nobody's feeling good today. It's terrible. So I'm just doing this. I'm gonna do the tabs. My horoscope just come up and it says your body is scared. Scared? Scared. I thought it was sacred. It's scared. I'm recording. I'm gonna try sitting on the recliner and see if I can use my Chromebook to finish it. Go ahead. See if it helps. Can you take Spyro with you? Okay, so this makes it look, try it. Okay. All right, so I got those white flowers. Can you see? Just a little bit, it's not gonna be too much. But I want it to be, you know. And then what I'm gonna do is take that other green, the fresh cut grass green. I'm give it a shake. I'm gonna dry this. And then go in and stripe it a little bit just so it has a little oh yeah, that's a nice green. That's a sagey green. To break up some of them, but just to kind of you know, then all of a sudden I put the purple and it's like, oh, the purple. Okay. Oh, I dig it. I really like it. Okay. So now I'm going to have to find some red. Yeah. So you could see it there. Good. In 
And while that dries, I can't remember, did I make this? What did I do there? Did I make that blue? Why is that? What did I do there? Okay, well, I'm going to try to take this off. I don't know what the heck I was doing. Did I even do a video? I know I had a video doing this. Oh, my dog's back. <laughs> oh, Lord. He doesn't know what the heck he wants. I thought he'd go sit with Dave. We'll see. I know what he wants. He wants the blanket underneath my desk that I put there for him. Like he's very, I have a very OCD family. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of spread this out. I know I don't want that line in there, but I wanna. I'm gonna have to take some gesso to get that. No, no, I should, I should probably try to go live today because I had it working, but I don't know. Let's see here now, just to get that out of there. I love gesso. I use gesso in every instance that I'm snorting that uh, white, you know. I just wanted to come on and do the lavender in a little, just a small video. I know you guys keep writing me in because I didn't do a video yesterday and you guys want to see videos and because it keeps you company and I know everybody doing the videos makes life a lot easier for everybody. So I thought I would do this and come on and smooth out my sky so I can decide what I want to do. it this way and then maybe I'll see maybe I'll try to go live and see if I can get it working again if it does the same thing as last time I quit <laughs> I'll figure it out but no I don't care I'm cutting some of that off because I'll just go back in and because I gotta those are just my base colors do you know what I mean I really want to, I can't quite decide, like, I mean, obviously it's mixed media already because we're using pencils and, um, Stabilo and acrylic paint, you know, the different things, but I can't quite decide how I don't usually paint like straight up acrylic paints unless I'm doing like I'm following somebody's um, thing, uh, tutorial because I'm not the greatest at it. So I really wanted to try to do my own. I don't think I could ever teach anybody to do, <laughs> to do what I'm doing here. Cause I just go off my, like, Oh, I want to do this. I want to do that. That's why I do a lot of, um, like using stuff at home and those kind of things, because I don't know if I could actually teach anybody to do anything because I'm such a blasted mess. But she's getting there. Like I said, I'm just kind of layering, just keep layering until I can decide. I, I, with this being the ocean, um, I want this to be the sky with the moon, but I might, I want some yellow, I think in it. I don't know. And it's going to be a little darker over this side, obviously, because of that, um, blue going through, but I, I like that. And again, I'm just laying cut, like laying it down. So it gets a little bit more, um, opaque so I can kind of see what I want to do.
I wish I could talk to you guys so I could be like, well, what do you guys think? Let me just add a little bit of water here to get this off that I just went over. And the hair. Okay, just for now. I'd love to see what you guys are doing. Always, if you have pictures or I'm on Facebook, I love seeing what you guys do. I know Cheryl just sent me um, pictures on there that she has been doing. Um, I know I'm in the All Things Creative group. You guys are always posting. I love seeing it. Even if it's not what I'm doing or what I'm showing. I just love seeing people be creative. Okay, that'll be that for now. I like the, like that. This I'm going to have to deal with. And I might put some um, mica flakes as well. Now I've been using these, these are American crafts it's called, and this came in the pouring stuff and I like it, but like it comes apart. I was using it the other day and it was like all of a sudden, cause it was a thicker paint. So I got to put glue in there. So these are good um, brushes. I do like these, but just know, like if you get it, what I would suggest is see if yours comes off and then glue it before you start working. Cause this one's on there tight, but that one just isn't. Um, okay. So now I'm going to grab red to put around my, um, sage. I like the way the sage is coming. I'm doing, doing, doing. Okay. So I need a bright red. Come on. No paint. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, so I have some cardinal red multi surface. So I'm going to give it a shake. Let's see. Use the thin brush, make sure there's no water on it because. That ruins a lot of my things. A little bit of red. And I'm going to like cross it like this. Yeah. It's my sage and I can do what I want. And then like cross. Yeah. I like that. That means something to me, like I said, because all of my sage is it's either red or it's red and white. And I could do white. Maybe I'll do a little trail of white after I dry that. Just the lowest. See, this is where I get. Emily says it's Aries who has too much gene, but I think Capricorn does as well. <laughs> Um, just to highlight it with the white. I like that. I'm, I like the way it came out. Mm, I do, I do, I do. Okay, so I'm going to rinse that. All right. Oh my goodness, girl. Better knock everything on. Let's go in one more time with my gesso. Why is she using gesso? Because she's too lazy to reach back here and get that white. Because I'm cleaning, and in the midst of me cleaning everything, everything's not put where it's supposed to be. So it's all right. I'm going to take some of this white off, though. I don't want too much. Come on, let's do a little cow. Yeah, okay. 
things that excite me. Ridiculous. Okay. Maybe this right here. All right. Okay. Let's see. I don't know if my light's killing that a little bit. All right, so you see I kind of got the sky, another layer of the white down till I decide. And I'm going to let all this dry because I know I'm going to put my arm in that and I love it. And I'm going to decide, you know, what's going next. Um, once I decide the sky and everything, I will then um, make sure I get all these the right size and, and all that kind of thing because I have my um, circles here. I have many different circle sizes. This is going to be too small, it looks like, but um, that I can go around to really circle it, but I'm not going to worry too much about it. I don't know. I'm kind of like, mm, and I think I need some gold. I don't know. Let me know down below. So as always, please be kind to each other. Again, let me know about somebody else is fighting. Thanks for sitting and watching me go through this and make my little sage bundle, sage and lavender. I'm so freaking excited about that one. And um, yeah. And hi, Danielle, if you're watching this. Oh my God. Hi to everybody. I could sit here and say hi to a million different people. And, um, if you saw at the beginning of the video, I'm starting to add, uh, people who are, um, Patreon or, um, on the memberships, a, a special thank you, which I'm so grateful. And if you're interested in uh, joining my memberships, they are down below. Um, one of them is to be in a live stream, which I'm going to be doing next week. And, yeah, I'm trying to learn all this out. So, you know, and learn how everything works. So please bear with me and, uh, thank you all for taking the time out of your day to watch this and any suggestions, please leave down below. I love it. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Be kind to each other. You never know about somebody else is fighting. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.